Um, welcome back to Prophetic Poets and Teachings. Does it fall in line with the will of God for you? It's a question that I believe that you should ponder upon. Sometimes you will want something and we desire something so badly. And it's fine, you know, you're human and your heart will want certain things. In fact, you might have you might have made your calculations and thought that this is perfect. This place that you're about to move to, to relocate to, this job that you're about to take on is right for you. You know, this might be the right thing to do. Some people even kind of know that that's not the will of God and still think that they can twist his mind or move his hands to just do things differently. But are you willing to go with the consequences? You know, the Israelites wouldn't have had all these issues with kings if they weren't desiring to be like other nations when they asked God for a king. Even though the God was leading them with his prophets and directing them, they wanted to look like other nations. Uh, and then they, the Lord gave them Saul. But, you know, it, it, how it ended with Saul was not well. He eventually fell off. He eventually kind of went outside of the will of God. That's why God put the tormenting spirits on him. Sometimes the things that you desire will bring you certain problems that you never had before. Are you willing to go with that or to go with the will of God? You know, the knowledge that Eve was seeking, or that, 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 that she accepted from the serpent came with consequences. Do you, don't, do you not want to be like a baby in the hands of the Lord and just let him mold you and, and take control every day and just have him do his will in your life? We need to pray, we need to discern that situation, that journey that you're about to embark on. Is it the will of God or is it just you wanting to do you? I'll see you guys next time.